Good morning, you guys. Today is my birthday, and I am on my way to urgent care. I turned 31 today, but yesterday, my heart started racing. I was exercising, my heart started racing, which, like, obviously, it's not a big deal. When you're exercising, you expect that your heart rate elevates, but um, it was kind of, like, uncomfortable at the time when I was exercising, and then it never slowed down. Like, it slowed down, but it didn't, it never got back to normal. So I kind of just waited it out. I thought like, you know, let me sleep on it. I also should say that I've experienced heart racing all of my life pretty much, and the doctors tell me, actually, let me change the seat. Like, I've seen a doctor for it before, and I was told I just have panic attacks, even though it's not brought on by any, like, emotional or mental stress. It's more like physical stress makes my heart race. But yeah, I've dealt with this many times in my life already, so that's why I kind of was just like, let me sleep on it. But it's the next day, and it's still happening, and I'm really experiencing some kind of like chest pain with it it's only on my left side it's only like right over my heart but I just figured let me be safe and sorry let me go and just get checked out because I'm, I am getting older so we're on our way to urgent care that's my birthday present <laughs> anyway we're still in quarantine and it's thunder well it was thunderstorming it's supposed to thunderstorm again so I really don't have anything planned for my birthday. I did want to maybe get in our little inflatable pool and barbecue or, you know, do your typical summer activities. But since the weather is not cooperating, I really didn't have anything planned. So why not go to urgent care? <laughs> the urgent care is only like 10 minutes away, if that. So I'm just going to focus on driving there, especially since... I'm still experiencing the heart palpitations, so I'm not gonna worry too much about recording me driving there. And I'll talk to you guys when I get there. got out of the shower I'm literally just sitting here in my towel it's been a couple of hours actually since I got home from urgent care but I've just been like chilling on the couch just trying to like relax and let my heart calm down basically um, but they did the EKG basically my numbers came back just fine the doctor had questions about how often this happens to me and things like that and so it does happen often enough um, so she just rec recommended that I go see a cardiologist and she let me go. Um, she told me no caffeine and no exercising today. So, um, I'm just going to be taking it easy, but I'm about to finally get dressed for the day and try to do something with my time. I at least want to put on some makeup, put on some clothes so that I can at the minimum take a picture. So I'm about to do my makeup and I figured you guys could watch I haven't done my makeup I don't even know in how long like basically since quarantine started so let's see if I even remember how to do this <laughs> tried to lay my baby hairs I'm not like the best at doing any of this stuff makeup or hair but I think I look pretty cute for my outfit I think I'm gonna put on this little thing it's it looks like a dress but it's actually shorts and it's new I've never wore it before so it's always nice to wear something fresh and new on your birthday so I'm gonna go ahead and get dressed then get my daughter dressed and then start our freaking day all right guys here is my outfit I actually really love it I did not realize the split was to the side I think that is so cute 
and then it can be worn kind of off the shoulders or you can also pull it up but I think it looks so much cuter off the shoulders so this is how I'll be wearing it I'll probably just throw on some sandals or flip-flops or something if I actually leave the house but I'm so happy I think I look really cute I'm back I changed my clothes to make the cake I don't want to get dirty she is wearing her cute little apron and chef's hat she got that for her birthday from her godmother and she was so excited to wear her apron I don't own an apron so so that's why I just changed my clothes she's all right, so we're about to make my birthday cake. Mommy's birthday cake. Yes, mommy's birthday cake. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited. It's delicious. It's delicious? Yeah. All right, help me pour the water in. Hot. It's not hot, baby. And then we need a half a cup of oil. Well, no water. Yeah, that's not water. That's oil. Yeah, water. Not water. Here you go, baby. Pour it in there. Good job. All right, you ready? Yeah. Me? Oh, I spilled it. Careful, be careful, mommy. Be careful? Yeah. Yeah, I need to be careful. Thank you. Thank you, mommy. You're welcome, baby. You ready? Yeah. All ready. Mommy. That's enough. All right, let's see how long we need to bake this. Or, really? well, cupcakes are 12 to 17 minutes, so let's check on it then. Well, Demi, it's actually time for you to take a nap, girl. No, yeah. Not yet? Yeah, no nap. Sorry. All right, guys, the cupcakes are in the oven. She needs to go and take a nap, so I'm about to put her down, even though she doesn't want to. And I'll wait for her to wake up before we frost the cupcakes. I might do the cake without her, though. Okay? Yeah. yeah. Okay. One, two, three. Don't blow my candle out, Demi Bites. Do not blow out my candle. Sing happy birthday. Happy birthday. One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Shadea. Happy birthday to you. Thank you guys. I'm gonna make a wish, Demi, because it's my birthday. And I'm gonna blow on my candle. Don't hit me. You wanna help me blow on my candle? Yeah. Okay, on a count of three. Wait, I gotta think of my wish. Wait, I gotta think of my wish. Wait! <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> yeah.